Nehemiah chapter 10. Now those that sealed were Nehemiah the Tershatha, the son of Hakaliah, and Zidkijah, Sariah, Azariah, Jeremiah, Pasher, Amariah, Malkijah, Hadish, Shebaniah, Malak, Haram, Merimoth, Obadiah, Daniel, Ginnathon, Barak, Meshulam, Abijah, Mijamin, Meaziah, Bilgei, Shemei. These were the priests. And the Levites, both Jeshua the son of Azaniah, Binuai of the sons of Henadad, Cadmiel, and their brethren, Shebaniah, Hodijah, Kelata, Peleiah, Hanan, Micah, Rehab, Hashabiah, Zachar, Sherebiah, Shebaniah, Hodijah, Benai, Beninu. The chief of the people, Parash, Paeth Moab, Elam, Zathu, Benai, Bunai, Asgad, Bebei, Adonijah, Bigvei, Aden, Ater, Hizkaijah, Azer, Hodijah, Hashem, Bezei, Harif, Anathoth, Nebei, Magpaish, Meshulam, Hezer, Meshezabil, Zadok, Jadua, Pelatiah, Hanan, Ananiah, Hoshea, Hananiah, Hashab, Helohesh, Pilaha, Shobek, Reum, Hashabna, Maaseah, and Ahijah, Hanan, Anan, Malak, Haram, Baana. And the rest of the people, the priests, the Levites, the porters, the singers, the Nethanims, and all that had separated themselves from the people of the lands unto the law of God, their wives, their sons, and their daughters, everyone having knowledge and having understanding. They clave to their brethren, their nobles, and entered into a curse and into an oath to walk in God's law, which was given by Moses, the servant of God, and to observe and do all the commandments of the Lord our Lord, and his judgments and his statutes. And that we would not give our daughters unto the people of the land, nor take their daughters for our sons. And if the people of the land bring ware or any victuals on the Sabbath day to sell, that we would not buy it of them on the Sabbath or on the holy day, and that we would leave the seventh year and the exaction of every debt. Also we made ordinances for us to charge ourselves yearly with the third part of a shekel for the service of the house of our God. For the showbread and for the continual meat offering and for the continual burnt offering of the Sabbaths, of the new moons, for the set feasts and for the holy things and for the sin offerings to make an atonement for Israel and for all the work of the house of our God. And we cast the lots among the priests, the Levites, and the people for the wood offering to bring it into the house of our God after the houses of our fathers at times appointed year by year to burn upon the altar of the Lord our God as it is written in the law. And to bring the first fruits of our ground and the first fruits of all fruit of all trees year by year unto the house of the Lord. Also the firstborn of our sons and of our cattle, as it is written in the law, and the firstlings of our herds and of our flocks, to bring to the house of our God unto the priests that minister in the house of our God. And that we should bring the first fruits of our dough and our offerings, and the fruit of all manner of trees, of wine, and of oil, unto the priests, to the chambers of the house of our God, and the tithes of our ground unto the Levites, that the same Levites might have the tithes in all the cities of our tillage. And the priest, the son of Aaron, shall be with the Levites when the Levites take tithes. And the Levites shall bring up the tithe of the tithes unto the house of our God, to the chambers, into the treasure house. For the children of Israel and the children of Levi shall bring the offering of the corn, of the new wine, and the oil unto the chambers where are the vessels of the sanctuary and the priests that minister, and the porters and the singers. And we will not forsake the house of our God. Nehemiah chapter 11 and the rulers of the people dwelt at Jerusalem. The rest of the people also cast lots to bring one of ten to dwell in Jerusalem, the holy city, and nine parts to dwell in other cities. And the people blessed all the men that willingly offered themselves to dwell at Jerusalem. Now these are the chief of the province that dwelt in Jerusalem. But in the cities of Judah dwelt everyone in his possession in their cities, to wit, Israel, 
the priests and the Levites and the Nethanims and the children of Solomon's servants. And at Jerusalem dwelt certain of the children of Judah and of the children of Benjamin. Of the children of Judah, Athaiah the son of Uzziah, the son of Zechariah, the son of Amariah, the son of Shephatiah, the son of Mahalaleel, of the children of Perez. And Maaseah the son of Barak, the son of Kohoza, the son of Hosea, the son of Adaiah, the son of Joyarib, the son of Zechariah, the son of Shiloni. All the sons of Perez that dwelt at Jerusalem were four hundred threescore and eight valiant men. And these are the sons of Benjamin, Salu the son of Meshulam, the son of Joed, the son of Padeah, the son of Koleiah, the son of Maaseah, the son of Ithiel, the son of Jeseah. And after him, Gabai, Selai, nine hundred twenty and eight. And Joel the son of Zichri was their overseer, and Judah the son of Senua was second over the city. Of the priests, Jadea the son of Joyarib, Jachin, Seraiah the son of Hilkiah, the son of Meshulam, the son of Zadok, the son of Meriath, the son of Ahitub, was the ruler of the house of God. And their brethren that did the work of the house were eight hundred twenty and two. And Adaiah the son of Jerohim, the son of Peleliah, the son of Amzai, the son of Zechariah, the son of Pasher, the son of Malchiah, and his brethren, chief of the fathers, two hundred forty and two. And Amashai the son of Azariel, the son of Ahasai, the son of Meshilamoth, the son of Immer. And their brethren, mighty men of valor, an hundred twenty and eight, and their overseer was Zabdiel, the son of one of the great men. Also of the Levites, Shemaiah the son of Hashab, the son of Azrakam, the son of Hashabiah, the son of Bunai, and Shabbatai and Josabad of the chief of the Levites had the oversight of the outward business of the house of God. And Madaniah the son of Micah, the son of Zabdi, the son of Asaph, was the principal to begin the thanksgiving in prayer. And Bakbakiah the second among his brethren, and Abda the son of Shemua, the son of Galil, the son of Jeduthun. All the Levites in the holy city were two hundred fourscore and four. Moreover, the porters, Achab, Talman, and their brethren that kept the gates were an hundred seventy and two. And the residue of Israel of the priests and the Levites were in all the cities of Judah, every one in his inheritance. But the Nethanims dwelt in Ophel, and Zihah and Gispa were over the Nethanims. The overseer also of the Levites at Jerusalem was Uzai, the son of Bani, the son of Hashabiah, the son of Mattatiah, the son of Micah. Of the sons of Asaph, the singers were over the business of the house of God. For it was the king's commandment concerning them that a certain portion should be for the singers due for every day. And Pethahiah the son of Meshezabel, of the children of Zerah the son of Judah, was at the king's hand in all matters concerning the people. And for the villages with their fields, some of the children of Judah dwelt at Kirjath Arba and in the villages thereof, and at Dibon and in the villages thereof, and at Jacabzeel and in the villages thereof, and at Jeshua and at Molada and at Bethphelet. And at Hazer Shul and at Beersheba and in the villages thereof, and at Ziklag and at Mechana and in the villages thereof, and at Edrimon and at Zaria and at Jarmuth, Zanoa, Adullam and in their villages, at Lachish and the fields thereof, at Azica and in the villages thereof, and they dwelt from Beersheba unto the valley of Hinnom. The children also of Benjamin from Geba dwelt at Michmash and Aijah and Bethel. And in their villages, and at Anathoth, Nob, Ananiah, Hazer, Rama, Gataim, Hadid, Zeboim, Nebalat, Lod, and Ono, the valley of craftsmen. And of the Levites were divisions in Judah and in Benjamin.